Okay, what's the difference between botany and horticulture? So botany is the study of plants in nature in their natural habitat. Horticulture is the study of taking care of and cultivating plants for use by humans. And that's the essential difference between the study of those two different fields. Uh, horticulture can be looking at growing food crops and developing food crops. It can be developing ornamental crops. It could be also developing uh, plants to be used medicinally as well. Is there overlap between these two areas of plant study? A hundred percent. Botany uh, is going to be more associated with the biology uh, and the inner workings of a plant. Horticulture is more about the growing conditions and how do you take care of and how do you breed plants and how do you landscape with plants and then how do people interact with plants in terms of landscape and landscape design and uh, also human consumption. Um, does it help to know both topics? Of course it does. That's why I teach both topics. So uh, will you, there'll be some overlap between those two courses? 100%, there absolutely will be. So one of the benefits of studying horticulture is uh, you can go into horticulture as a field straight out of high school. So you can, you could even be working on it while you're in high school. I have many students who have gone and worked at nurseries and that is an area of horticulture that you can study. Uh, you can also work with the landscaper. You can also uh, work on a farm. You can also work in floral design. Uh, all of those things are all part of the horticultural field. My class in particular is aligned with South Seattle Community College. So you can take my class and if you decided you wanted to go to South Seattle Community College program on horticulture, you can get credit for that program in my class. In other words, you get free college credit. So that's kind of an awesome thing. I have uh, many students who have actually gone on and are working in the horticultural field. Some who are mushroom growers, some who are working in landscaping, some who have their own businesses, um, some who are working in environmental science and their horticultural background help them with that, some who are working in sustainable landscape design. So there's all kinds of things you can do with studying horticulture.